I am Rebecca, and these are my reviews, and I have yet another new and interesting things for you. So I try to do these monthly, usually at the end of the month. I almost always end up doing them at the beginning of the next month because I'm always late, but hey, that's all right. So today is June 1st, which marks the month of my birthday, my birth month, if you will. So anyway, I am very excited and I have a lot of stuff here. <laughs> Most of this is hair stuff, but that's okay. All right, so first let's start with these little guys. These are actually geared toward kids and they are bath bombs. And they have these cutesy patootsy little animals on them. This is from a company called Sudbuds. And when you open them, they have like a little card inside that tells you a little something something about the animal. So like this one's a tiger, this one's a hippopotamus, and then you get a golden ticket like so. It has information on it and you could just go to like the website and you get, you know, I don't know, 15% off your next one or you know something like that and little games and stuff like that that you can play. Um, the bath bombs themselves, I was expecting them to be animals. They are not. It's just a round ball and there's nothing in them or anything. It's just a fun bath bomb for you know kids. I mean I know all of my bath bombs always go to my kids. My kids love bath bombs. So I was, I was happy to have those. I think those are cool. Um, and then also with that, the company also sent me this little guy. This is the Hippo Bubble Maker. Now this guy, um, I couldn't get to work for me. It has like this little thing in here and you dump your bubbles in there and then you can just turn it on rather loud and he's supposed to spit out bubbles but my uh, my homemade bubble mixture wasn't working very well so I don't know maybe if I had proper bubbles it would work better because I thought he was cute just have a little a little hippo there blowing bubbles at you so anyway I will leave all of the information for that in the description box along with everything anything you see in this video a lot of it was sent to me so I may have discount codes so I will leave links for everything and then even the stuff that I bought myself I'll try to link so that you can you know figure out where to get it such as <laughs> this little guy right here. So this, well, this is from Real Techniques. This is just their like brush cleaning thing, which I love and use every time I wash my brushes. And this is from Shea Moisture. I love the stuff from this company. I really do. First of all, this bar smells amazing. It's like wafting over here and I'm like, oh, everything smells amazing like coconuts. It's such a nice warm sunny day out today. So I'm feeling the summer vibes. So anyway, back to the bar. This is their, it's like 100%, I, I didn't keep the paper. I should have kept the paper that goes over it. It's like 100% coconut oil, something or other, bar of soap. And there's a line that goes with this. They have a moisturizer and shampoo and all of this other stuff. And I almost got the moisturizer, except that they only have pump tops on their stuff and you can't really squeeze the bottle. And their moisturizers are so thick that you need to be able to squeeze them. So I, I wish that they would change that. Anyway, this bar I have been using to wash my brushes, which is why it was sitting on top of this thing. Uh, once upon a time, my auntie who lives in Canada and has a goat farm uh, makes all sorts of fabulous things, including this coconut face bar. It's like, it's supposed to be for your face, but it, she uses goat's milk and coconut oil. And it is the most wonderful thing for washing my brushes. And then I tried one from Tiny House Apothecary, but that one is made with olive oil and the olive oil, it just isn't quite as good as the coconut oil. So when I saw this, I was like, Ooh, I wonder because this is only like $6 and you can get it at Rite Aid. I don't have to go back to Canada. So it's fantastic. It's absolutely wonderful. I would highly, highly recommend getting this bar of soap for $6 and it's huge and it does an amazing job of washing my brushes, even like my foundation stuff, which is harder to get out because the creamy, like you need a good oil based cleanser to get that stuff out. And this is amazeballs. So I would recommend that. Okay, and I bought that myself, so I'll leave you a link to Rite Aid or something, Target, Ulta, I don't know, you can get it at any drugstore basically. Okay, oh, this is actually, I got this at Gen Beauty and this is from The Bomb and it's just a little trio of, this is Desert Bomb, which is, I, which I've had forever and is amazing. It's a nice bronzy blushy color and then two other blush colors, which I just love and they're matte, they're easy to use, easy, anytime with any look, you know, nice neutral shades. I just, I really loved that. So I thought that I would include it. These, I got at Target. I was so excited when I saw this because I had seen Marlena posted that Makeup Geek was now at Target and I was like, eek. So I went to Target and then I saw that they had all this other stuff too, including Violet Voss lashes. I've never tried Violet Voss before and I was super excited. Look at these. Aren't these gorgeous? I cannot wait to wear these. 
I'm so excited. They only had like three different styles, but that's okay by me. I only got one. They were like $10, I think. So, um, and then speaking of which, the Makeup Geek, I just picked up this one little thing. This is the Showstopper, what's this actually called? Like a cream stain in arabesque, and I love it love this color. Their cream stains are really nice. It's like a matte finish, but it goes on very creamy feeling. I mean, it's not super hydrating, but it's not really a liquid lipstick either. It's, you know, it's a cream stain. What do you want? But anyway, this color is gorgeous. I love these lilac-y, pinky purple tones. And I have another nude shade. I can't remember the name of it. I'll post it here for you, um, that I really, really love. So anyway, I was excited to get that. They didn't have very much stuff at Target, but you know, a couple of things. So this I also got at Gen Beauty, but you can get this at any old drugstore. This is from Physicians Formula, and this is the Spotlight Illuminating Primer. I love this. It is quite illuminating. It actually reminds me a lot of the Becca Backlight Primer, which is one of my favorites. It's very hydrating, very luminous. I don't think you could get away with wearing this on its own unless you like just you know, carefully placed it on your cheeks or something. I mean, cause look how luminous that is. But I just think it's beautiful as a primer. It just hydrates your skin and does make you look a little more luminous even after putting a different foundation on top of it. I just, I really, really like this. And like I said, I feel like it's a dupe for the Becca Backlight Primer, so. Another Physicians Formula thing that I picked up, one of their butter highlighters. This one is in the shade Champagne. I am wearing it today and I love it so much. These really are so buttery. Like when you stick your finger in this, it's, it's like crazy soft. It's got this intensely amazing texture to it. And it's, sorry. I dropped that. It's intense and it's beautiful. I love this shade. I'm gonna try to not put it on my already luminous uh, hand there. Can you see this? Can you see this? It's a gorgeous goldeny champagne tone and I just, I super love it. So yeah, I've got it on today. I've worn it for the last uh, two days that I think I've owned this and I'm absolutely in love with it. I definitely need to get more of these. I especially want that super pink one because I really like those as like blush toppers. I think they look really pretty. I have these home cube plugs and these are basically just smart plugs. So you plug this into your wall and then you plug something into it like your lights or I don't know, whatever you want to plug something in. And then you can say, Alexa, turn on my lights. And this is connected to it. So your lights will just turn on. So you've got like voice command. You can also use your phone to just be like, turn on the lights. So you can do it remotely from wherever you are, which it comes in handy a lot, honestly. Like in my kid's room, they have these twinkle lights behind their bed that, that they use basically as their nightlight, but the plug is behind their bed, so I can't like get back there and plug it in every night. So I use one of these and then and then I can just, you know, turn it on with my phone and then they have their nightlight on. So, you know, things like that or like the outside patio lights or something like that where I can just do remotely. It's so much easier and it just comes in handy. So I love these kind of things. You can get these on Amazon for, I think the two pack was like $26 or something like that. Then I've got a ton of hair stuff. So I posted on Instagram that I went to the launch party for Nature Lab Tokyo, which this company has actually been around for like 20 years, but it's just, new to the US and they're basically launching a new brand here by the company that's been around forever. So anyway, if that makes sense. Uh, anyway, I talked to a stylist about what would be good for my hair and she like did my hair and you know, it was like, oh yeah, with your texture, blah, blah, blah. These are the products that I recommend for you. So I got the Re Perfect Repair Shampoo and Conditioner as well as the Perfect Shine Oil Mist and the Perfect Volume Texture Mist. My mom went with me and she actually got different stuff. So I talked to her and she said that so far she's been loving everything. She especially loves the oil mist. She said it's not oily at all. It just makes her hair look shiny and super healthy and she loves it. So that was good to hear. And then I've been using the texture mist, which you can put on your hair before you style it or um, the stylist actually sprayed it in her hands and then kind of scrunched up my hair after styling it. And it really does just leave your hair kind of textured, kind of PC and not looking like greasy or oily or anything. It just, it, but it just adds some texture without being crunchy. It doesn't stick to your tools to like your curling iron or something, you know, it's just, I'm, I'm really impressed with it. And then the shampoo and conditioner, 
leave my hair feeling so silky, like just silky, silky soft. I mean, it can have tangles in it and it still feels silky soft. I, it's not great for like when I wanna curl my hair cause then it's just too silky soft. But when I've just, but when I'm just wearing my hair down and straight or even, you know, putting it in a ponytail or something, it just feels so, Okay, I can't think of another word other than silky. It just, it feels silky and I love it. So, and, and all of this stuff smells like, like a sweet green tea scent, which I actually really like. Um, and then I also got the Perfect Repair Treatment Mask, which I've been using in my blue stripe and it's wonderful, I love it. So I'm really happy about all of those products and obviously cruelty-free, cause you know I'm all about the cruelty-free these days. Okay, and then I also got a bunch of stuff from Mark Anthony. So some of this I got from Gen Beauty and then they actually sent me a whole bunch of stuff too, which I was super excited about. So these are their cocktail styling gels. This one is the Smoothing Cocktail, which has smoothing cream and glossing lotion. This one is the Curl Cocktail, which has defrizzing de lotion and defining cream. And then the one that I have mostly been using is the Volume Cocktail, which, is, which has has volumizing cream and root lift souffle. So the way these work, they have two separate things down here. So you can kind of, you know, do a little of this, a little of that, equal parts, however you want to do it. It truly is like a cocktail. You mix how much of each thing you want, or if you just want one of them, depending on your hair, how you're styling it that day, whatever. And you know, you can just mix your own little thing, which I thought was so cool and so cute. I absolutely love that. So those have been a lot of fun to play with. And then they sent me all of this stuff from their strengthening grow long line because my hair has been growing out. It's getting super long and I really needed to switch up and get something for long hair. My hair's getting a lot more tangly and I have really thick, heavy hair. So I definitely needed a, you know, just something else. And so I was really excited to try this brand because I feel like this is perfect for my longer hair and I am continuing to grow out my hair. So this is the shampoo and conditioner. They smell really great. They smell, they have the kind of this floral, fruity, sweet scent that I really like. And I definitely love the shampoo and conditioner. It doesn't leave my hair silky like the other stuff does, but it does leave it just kind of bouncy and clean feeling. <laughs> Um, this is the Volumizing Dry Shampoo Foam. It's basically a mousse, and I used it in my hair today, and you basically, you know, it's just it's just a mousse, and then you work it into your roots, and you can blow dry your hair upside down to get extra volume and lift, or, you know, just let it air dry or whatever, and it helps soak up those oils, and also just giving you some volume and some texture. I really love the mousse idea. I feel like it's maybe not as oil soaking as like some of the spray on shampoos that I've used, but I love that it gives you that volume and texture and it does make your hair kind of look just clean, not necessarily dried out and textured, if that makes sense. You know, like right now my hair just feels clean and this is, I'm going on three, four days. <laughs> so anyway, I, I really do love this mousse. And then this is the leave-in conditioner spray, which works amazingly well. I've been using it on my hair. I've been using it on my four-year-old's very tangly hair, and it just works really wonderfully to, you know, get all those tangles out. And then this tiny little thing is actually a hair mask, which again, I like to use on my blue stripe. And this is super fast miracle treatment. So this is supposed to help your hair grow, but mostly I like to use it on this part of my hair because this is the damaged part of my hair and it really does just help rehydrate and make everything look healthy basically <laughs> so oh and then I have this deck of cards let's see this was sent to me so I do have a 15% off code this is a deck of cards this is Pipman playing cards and it's just a regular deck of cards but the artwork on these are so cute so I think these are the jokers right here but you see they're like these little you know stick men kind of things and then you know you've got all just these cool pictures all of this fun artwork on here and so you know and I love to play cards I like playing solitaire or the kids and I will play uh we'll play go fish or war or, you know whatever we can come up with crazy eights and we just, you know, I love playing, I love card games. So this is such a fun little set. I love that it's not just, you know, your typical bicycle playing cards. It's got super fun artwork on it. So those are super cute. And then I have a bunch of lip products from Laritzi. I got these at Gen Beauty. I have two liquid lipsticks, Tidal and Power, and they're 
The formula is great on these. They're really pretty, they last all day, they're not super drying, you know I mean? They're not hydrating, it's a liquid lipstick. But they do last really long, they don't transfer, and the colors are gorgeous. And then these three are lip glosses. I've been wearing nudes a ton because I just love this color. It's such a pretty nude shade, it's kind of mauve-y, and I don't know, I just really like it. And then this one is one of those like holographic, fun, it almost looks kind of purpley on your lips, and you can, you know, use it on top of something or on its own and it's just a really pretty gloss and then this this one is just clear but I really like the formula on all of these this is a Canadian company by the way let's see oh another gen beauty this is from pure cosmetics and I think that they only sell these in like a five pack and you get different colors and it's a liquid eyeshadow that kind of turns almost into a powder I guess, you know, it kind of dries down, but it has a really neat texture to it. And it's just shimmery and beautiful and blends out really nicely. And it works great as a base or just on its own. Sorry, it's like blending in with my, with my shimmery primer. Anyway, this champagne color is really lovely and I really, really like these. And then these, somebody actually suggested I get these after uh, my last new and interesting things when I mentioned some hairpins for my daughter's ballet bun and they said to try these twisty ones and i had seen these before but i was always terrified of them because they just look like they're going to get tangled in your hair right but i bought these yesterday and i put them in a hair and i've put them in my hair a couple of times and basically you just twist it in clockwise like a screw and then untwist it counterclockwise and it hasn't gotten stuck in my hair so far and it works amazingly well to hold your hair in place and it doesn't give you those bobby pin headaches you know because it's not pressing against your head it's just screwing everything in place. They're amazing. I love these. They're genius. So thank you to whoever that was that told me to get those. I'm no longer afraid and they are amazing. And then finally, I have my Up Bra bathing suit. So I did actually do a review on Up Bra before, so I will link that. You can check out basically, you know, how it works and my thoughts on it. I love this thing. Um, so the bikini has the same technology where you pull these things and where you pull these things and then tuck them in here and it gives you a little extra lift. And the bathing suit, you can either wear strapless or as a halter and it has just, you know, basic little bottoms. You know, not, not too skimpy, but not super full coverage either. It's a nice medium bikini. And the top is just amazing. I've actually posted a couple pictures of this on Instagram. I wore it to, I wore it the other day and I went swimming and it was perfectly fine and wonderful. It lasted well, it stayed on, it kept me lifted and looking super awesome. So I'm really, really happy with it. Plus I just love this shade of blue. I think they also have a red one and I don't know. Anyway, I will link that in the description as well. So that is it. Those are all of my new and interesting things. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out the description box if you saw anything you are interested in and you know I may or may not have discount codes but I will try to link everything so that you can find it. Thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Bye!